Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, this is another OnePlus 3 update for that. And the morning I've shown you uh, the 20 plus features uh, for this uh, OnePlus 3 running the Oxygen OS build 3.5.2. So as you can see here, so a few features are missed from me. And uh, a very new feature that is added to this build is the 60 FPS uh, on the video recording in the 1080 boot, uh, not on the else. And also there is a new feature uh, which is called this uh, LS slider. So this is uh, dynamically moving adjusting itself. So when you turn on this uh, automatically adjust brightness on inside the setting that you can find it here. If you just go inside this setting and uh, under the display. So there's a section called adaptive brightness. So once you turn that on, so it keeps on changing that. And so before filming this video, uh, I it, it was at very start of the year. It just moved here. So hopefully, uh, according to the light, it gets adjust itself. Now we'll talk about uh, this FPS stuff. So first of all, in case you don't know about what is frame per second, so frame per second is a unit that measures display device performance. It consists of a number of complete scans of the display screen that occurs each per second. So in short, when you try to capture any video, uh, in internally it is created on the millions of the images what is you're taking on that for example if just recording a uh, three seconds five seconds video so it's possible that it may take thousands of uh, images there and at the final it just combined and makes a complete video so, so in short in, in case you have the more fps the better will the video quality because the camera is able to take more frames per second and the video will be more smooth and you will get better clarity and all the stuffs all right so this is what you can see this is the default camera and once you toggle it to the video mode just click here you will see here inside the 1080p you can see there's a 60 fps right if i just make it close here so uh, it's only available on the 1080p just 780p nothing else is here 4k nothing else is here so and also it also got 30 fps per second first is 30 fps if you just click again it got 60 fps per second so, all right so also i have taken a couple of the attack sample monsters so i will play that too so i did found that once i turned on 60 fps so the uh, video brightness was completely dim so now you'll take a clip here so this is a, a 30 fps you can see we'll just take 10 second film here and i also if i just make a zoom here come back here now now the same we'll try to take on the 60 fps we'll see uh, how much is the difference actually when you want that so uh, maybe we'll get a better zoom quality so we can take a better video here and uh, this is what is here now the couple of things also added here on this camera update once you go inside the setting you will see uh, inside this when you are in this uh, photo mode you can uh, take uh, this uh, raw photos too so here you can see this raw still raw images too click back here so this is about this 60 fps so let's see the couple of the samples that i have taken first and i'm filming at uh, 30 fps as you can see so if i just make a zoom here and come back here that's all right and it's nothing fine seeing a lot of uh, noises here so and also getting some problem in touching focus you can see and uh, yeah now it got the focus i'm doing at 60 fps as you can see i'm shocked to see like uh, complete uh, uh, brightness is gone and uh, zooming and getting in is fine and its focus is also very faster at 60 fps but uh, brightness is very low as you can see and yes getting now it's focus now so guys we have already taken the sample you might be thinking like uh, how to enable that because i have many comments on the morning video uh, many people still don't have the 60 fps so there's a solution for that too so here's how you can solve the uh, this uh, fps user, and you can enable the 60 fps on your default stock camera on running oneplus 3 this is a default camera as you can see uh, before fixing that problem here yeah. so here's one uh, 724k then the 1080p again even if you try to record that uh, it's not fixing too so as you can see i'm just recording still not able to fix that now uh, to fix that close the camera app again and go back to the settings here's the one under the apps find the camera app so here is the camera app we just need to uh, look here inside the storage so once you go inside the storage you need to clear both the cache and the clear data so once you clear that after that make sure to close the settings apps again and if you just go and open the camera app again it will again went to the default state so just uh, click uh, got it here and uh, try to see there so once you again go back to the video here and try to change the mode here you can see we are now able to see this 1080p at the 60 fps so that's how you can fix that 
uh, 30 fps seconds it will just take 10 second film here and I also if I just make a zoom here come back here now this is the difference actually when you want that so uh, maybe you will get a better zoom quality so we can take a better video here and uh, so I hope you guys found this video helpful and you can see I just told you uh, this automatically got adjusted here so when I lock my phone I turn back on so it moved to the back here so this is very nice feature here so a couple of people were thinking it's a bug actually but it's not a bug and by the way if you want this wallpaper I'm posting all my daily videos wallpaper on my Facebook page so make sure to follow and subscribe there to get all the you can get the same on my Twitter too on my Facebook page too. so this is Saurabh and thanks for watching guys I'll talk to you very soon in my next video have a great day